I can tell you, and I'll say it again, the Communist Party definitely has this capability, that is, long-range traction technology. It's very mature. I can only say this after seeing it myself. This is why our boat, Lady May, lost control on the Hudson River. That was the first thing I thought of. I put my phone from the big boat to the small boat next to it. Oh well, that's it. If I take it back again, on the big boat, it won't work again. Big boat lost control. If you put it back, on the small boat, it big boat, is fine again. But it will not work again. It will be fine again. And it will come back again and again. All depends on where I put my phone. I finally concluded that there was something wrong with my phone. When the FBI later went to the ship to investigate this matter, everyone in the FBI was dumbfounded. This was the first time they understood in this case that the CCP absolutely mastered this technology. When I met with the CIA, they were also very surprised about this ship. And they said that they are convinced that the Communist Party now has this mature technology. Why did I tell all the relevant departments during my many testimonies? If you don't believe that the CCP can take away all the modern technology that has computers in the United States, all airplanes, cars, yachts, and ships with computers and chips, including the smart home in your home, they, CCP, can control it all. So, comrades in arms, when we deal with the evil enemy the Communist Party, we can only overestimate and never underestimate the enemy. For Taiwan, this Black Hawk helicopter... Reason for the accident, like the shoulder-fired missiles, and other things where people are speculating gun shooting etc. I think it's impossible. There is only one thing. It is very easy to tamper with a mobile phone. CCP did the trick by using the traction technique to shut it down. Do it as they please, and everyone has to listen now. Basically, you can die wherever they want. It can definitely be done. I personally experienced this firsthand, on a boat, in Manhattan with my whole family. Let's go back and look through it again. Of course, the captain has been fired by us, and the entire team has been fired. In his words, this was the most terrifying moment in his life. One of the most advanced ships in the world. The ship is regarded as the originator of having most military technology in the entire human race. The boat won the technology and design awards for four years. It was so scary to start spinning out of control on the Hudson River. Just think about it. In the end, people didn't dare to work on that ship, and even the management company didn't dare to work on it. Strictly speaking, it wasn't us who fired, fired. It was themselves who resigned. The people at the FBI were dumbfounded, and the CIA was even more dumbfounded. 